Welcome back to Jibber Jab Reviews, everyone. Well, my Galaxy Watch 3 arrived yesterday, so I haven't had a lot of time to do a full review yet, but I have been playing around with it, and I found one feature in the watch that I really liked, and in fact, it's an idea that I came up with over two years ago. Curious yet? Stick around and I'll show you. And Samsung, stop reading my mind. Seriously, stop it. Alright guys, like I said, I'm still testing out the watch as well as this updated Tizen operating system. And in the watch faces area, I stumbled across this feature called Shuffle. And I actually laughed out loud when I saw this because this is an idea that I shared with a developer two years ago to see if an app could be created for this specific function. And it's a very simple feature, so I'm surprised it took this long for Samsung to add it. But I think it's a very cool one, especially if you're someone that has dozens and dozens of watch faces on your watch and if you're a regular viewer of this channel then you probably have no shortage of faces so all this feature does is it allows you to select watch faces to automatically change on your watch based on a certain duration of time and you have the option of selecting all the watch faces currently loaded on your watch or you can manually select just your favorites that you want to be included in this shuffle. Now, after you selected those, then you can set the duration, which is going to change those faces every hour, day, or week. So if you set it per day, then each morning you wake up, you're going to get a different watch face on for that day. Or if you really want to switch it up, then you can set it per hour, which means you're going to get 24 different looks on your face per day. Now, granted, nobody stays awake 24 hours a day, but if you have a typical nine to five job, then you'll at least get eight different designs during your workday. Just keep in mind that this shuffle feature is based on the faces that are already loaded on your watch, which means you won't have the ability to select them directly from your Samsung account. You must first install them to your watch, and then you'll have the ability to add that shuffle feature to them. Anyways, this is a fun feature that's currently available in the Galaxy Watch 3 that I wanted to share with all of you, and I fully expect it to be available on the Galaxy Watch and other models when Samsung rolls out a Tizen software update, which if we follow previous updates is usually within a couple months of a new watch model being released. Thanks again for watching, and stay tuned because more Galaxy Watch 3 reviews will be coming out again very soon. I'll see you all in our next video. Until then, take care.